Hey there, rock stars. Eric Andres. Today we're going to learn how to play Love Her Madly by The Doors. I'm going to jump into it right away, and then any of the bits and pieces that you need help with, stick around and I'll show you how to do it. Okay? A um, lot of open chords in this one. I'm trying to think if there's any bar chords. I don't think there is. Here we go. It's going to go something like this. I'm going to stop right there because if you know that, you know the whole song. Okay? So, all open chords here, super easy. The chords we're using are A minor, G, D, E minor, or E major, and C. I think that's it, right? Those are just your basic open chords. If you don't know those, you need to. If you'd like to know them or anything else about guitar, go to yourguitarstage.com. Link is below. Get the free ebook. Also make you privy to all the other free books that as I publish them, I give them to you. That's right. I send them to my inner circle for free before I publish them. Yeah, literally. Usually one a month. So here we go. Um, so the chords are A minor. I always thumb that low E string to mute it, you know. And then I'm doing this bit, this right hand muting part where I go. If you need help with that here on, your, on YouTube, type in your Guitar Sage uh, right hand muting. And I'll have a video for that. Okay, so um, this is A minor. D. A minor da, 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 da. C F D A minor Love her wish E major Love her as she's walking out the door Actually make that an E7 Walking out the door E major or E7 will work like she did one thousand times before and now it will repeat that but then there's this b section if you will or c section maybe um ouch c section so um then it goes so it goes all alone and robbie Krieger's doing this thing on the d he's playing like a uh, a couple of d suspendeds uh, you don't have to know what that means but you can just do this with your finger um, you can go. So he's doing this little melody line on the first string. That's what I call chord noodling. If you want to know more about that to where you can strum these chords. To, to just liven up plain old chord playing. If you want some more information about that here on YouTube, type in Your Guitar Sage Chord Noodling. And I've got a video for that, okay? Um, free ebook has some patterns for you as well. So, um, what were you we saying? So, all alone. You can just play a D on this if you don't want to um, noodle these notes. All alone. All alone. So here we have a G, C, A 
A major. D, right? And then we have this. And so what he's doing there is he's playing C, D, G, E minor, A minor. It's a handful, right? If you're new to chords, that will be a little bit taxing, a little bit trying for you. So uh, work up your speed, take your time on this, okay? Um, this stuff doesn't happen overnight, it just takes time. Anybody can play the guitar, just like anybody can be a doctor or a lawyer, if you go to school and if you practice and if you do all the things necessary to excel. So you can play guitar better than me if you practice. And I could play better than Ingve Malmsteen if I practice as long as he does, but I don't, so not as good. So you can be as good as you want um, if you have good instruction and if you practice right. So I'm the good instruction part. If you need help with that, um, hit me up here. Um, probably not on YouTube because I don't answer those questions um, very much because I just am not on YouTube a lot except when I upload my videos. So if you need questions answered regarding this video or any of them, hit me up on Facebook or Twitter. Links are below. Get the free ebook at yourguitarsage.com, the free video series that isn't anywhere except for at unstoppableguitarsystem.com. And uh, spay and new your kitties and dogs. I'm Eric Andreas, your guitar sage. See ya. Don't you love my lips?